going on this weekend. The smell of chilies, of course, roasting, filling the air in Pueblo this weekend for the annual Chili and Frijoles Festival downtown. As News 5's Maggie Bryan shows us, for some families, this weekend marks a special tradition. We're lucky enough to have Joe DiTomaso here roasting up the first batches of green chili for the weekend. I caught up with him earlier in the week and he told me that decades ago when the festival had first started, he remembers it being just a block long with around six vendors. And although it's grown over time, the roasting of the chili stays the same. Well, there's a lot of people that uh, never have purchased chili before, don't know anything about roasted chili. And you know, you have to explain them and go through the process. It's kind of interesting to talk to some people that, uh, that don't know and it's for a new experience for them for the first time. Di Tommaso says they will continue to pick the chilies until the first frost. So he's hoping for a late one this year. And you can get the Pueblo roasted green chili at almost every farm vendor here at the festival. In Pueblo, I'm Maggie Bryan, News 5.